This little guy is Bertie. We named him Bertie. He came in with Angus. He was also found same cage without food, without water in the Ballinger Creek area. So again, if you have pets in your family and you can't keep them, um, the most appropriate thing you can do is, uh, well, initially just make that commitment to keeping them, but if you find that you can't, the shelter should be a, a, a last resort, but then please do deliver them to the shelter. Um, and that way, not only do we know that they have been safely transported, uh, we can ask you information, and the information that we need is painless. We need to know what they've been eating, how they've been kept, uh, how often their cage was cleaned, if they have been around small children, if they've been around dogs, cats, other animals. All of that information, while it may seem irrelevant, um, while it might seem like a, a lengthy process, you know, I'm, I'm turning in my guinea pig, do you really need to know all that information? Well, yes, we do. In order to rehome these animals appropriately, we want to know as much information as we can to pass on to the next adopter, the next family, the next um, the next people that will be making a commitment to these guys. So Bertie came to us, um, again, same situation as Angus. We went ahead and had him vet checked as well, and he's, he's perfectly healthy, he's fine. Um, guinea pigs in general need a special diet in addition to guinea pig pellets. You need to incorporate dark greens into their diet. We do have an excellent website. We work closely with Small Angels Rescue. They help us out tremendously by pulling animals, but at this point in time, they are overloaded and swamped as well with small animals. So we have um, a n large number of guinea pigs that are in, in the shelter at the moment. But we, we utilize the Small Angels reference materials. If you go to their website or we print it out here um, as well and have it available as far as what guinea pigs need, what housing units they need, what kind of overall care, uh, vet care, diet, housing, and they do need enrichment. Guinea pigs need some sort of exercise. They can't, um, they, they can survive in a cage, but they need to be allowed outside to experience um, outside of their cage, inside your home in a safe environment. Let me reiterate, inside your home. Um, but just on different carpet squares where you're supervising inside a little exercise pen that they can have just some stretch time outside of their normal habitat of a cage. So again, this little guy is Bertie. He is adorable and he is one of many guinea pigs that is looking for a forever home.